What's going on, everybody? As always, it's a blessing to be here. You're here with the UL Exchange. I'm the Forex Finesse, the Crypto Caressa, and the Stock Successa. In today's video, we'll be talking about Shiba Inu accepted for payment by the world's largest breast cancer by the world's largest breast cancer charity, and also how over 880.9 million SHIB have been burned so far. So by that being said, guys, before we get into the articles and the technical analysis of Shiba and your coin, if you guys are new to this channel or if, or if you guys still have come or if you guys have been coming to this channel but still have not subscribed to the channel, then by all means, I urge you guys to subscribe to this channel with the bell notification so you can be notified every single time I drop information packed videos just like the one you're watching right now. And by that being said, let's just get right into this video after this beautiful intro. All right, guys, so first things first, market cap for the whole cryptos have increased for over $150 billion, so currently sitting at $2.3 trillion. 24-hour volume is looking nice at $74 billion, and dominance is currently around the same, 40.1 Bitcoin and 20.1 Ethereum. Ethereum gas fees is sitting a little low today at 47 guai. And you guys can see a lot of green in the markets as well, which is very good. And now let's focus on Shiba Inu for the 24-hour period. It's just started, but it's up 2.01%. In the seven-day period, it is up for 29.90%, putting it at a total price of currently four zeros and a three three, four zeros and a three eight one seven. And still currently at the number 13 spot. Now let's get straight into the articles. So first things first, Shiba Inu and Bitcoin and Dogecoin are now accepted by the world's largest breast cancer charity. The organization that has been at the forefront of the war against breast cancer now supports cryptocurrencies. Let's get into it. Susan G. Komen, the leading breast cancer organization in the world, has announced that it has now accepts has announced that it now accepts cryptocurrencies in partnership with donation solutions. The Giving Block. And we'll take a look into what the Giving Block is. So it's a website basically where you can donate crypto. Or if you're assigning a charity organization for yourself, then you can accept cryptos. So this is what they do. You just come here, click on the campaigns, and just wait a little bit. You see the Crypto Giving Pledge, Bag Season, Crypto Giving Tuesday, NFT Tuesday. So they're all implementing cryptocurrencies into the donations for these charities. I see a great thing happening in cryptocurrencies where it's being more involved and it's being used as donations because it's very great thing to use cryptocurrencies as donations, how it will reach the recipient or the charity faster and they're able to use that money in, in the, whichever way they please and it's all online digitally so it's easier to transfer as well. But I know a cryptocurrency that's built for a gifting platform, but that's another video. So the popular crypto charity platform offers a wide selection of digital assets, including such meme coins as Dogecoin, Shiba Inu, and Doge Elon Mars Elon, as well as such relative arcane cryptocurrencies such as Gala, Orchid, and Civic. The foundation is named after Susan Goodman Komen, a fashion model who was diagnosed with breast cancer at the age of 33 and passed away three years later. And she rests in peace. Her younger sister, Nancy, is the one that founded the organization in 1980. But take a look at this. Coleman needs donations in order to be able to provide health awareness education and fund research into breast cancer. Its investment in research has topped $1.1 billion since 1982. That's a lot of money, guys, and that can be utilized in such different ways to where they can be able to grow this money and still continue to do the research and giving awareness and education of breast cancer to different people around the world. So instead of that money just sitting in a bank, it's invested into crypto, or they're receiving the crypto as payments and the crypto prices rise, then they have more opportunities to do what they want to do and they can expand in a bigger and higher place. So a mainstay in crypto charity, cryptocurrency holders 
are encouraged to donate, encouraged, okay guys, to donate crypto instead of cash, since it's more tax efficient. It should be noted that the Internal Revenue Service, IRS, classifies crypto as a property for tax purposes. Founded back in 2018, the Giving Block has already partnered with hundreds of charities, Humanity Forward, a non-profit founded by Andrew Yang started accepting cryptocurrencies in May. And this is another thing as well. Earlier this month, the Giving Block announced a new service that aims to make the process of donating cryptocurrencies easier for wealthy individuals. So if you ask why would why would a crypto donating cryptocurrencies be easier and why would it be friendly to people that are wealthy and you know people that have millions and billions of dollars and that want to evade taxes or get away from paying taxes to the government but pay their fair share of donations to the people that need it, it's easier because you can just quickly transfer and write this off as a donation in your taxes as well. But that's also for a different topic. But I'm just giving you guys the basis of why they are doing this. So now let's get into the more serious but also fun news. 240 million ship destroyed at Christmas. 880.9 million burned since mid-fall. And as you guys can see here, you guys can see over 800 million ship burned since mid-fall. The company started burning ship in Shiba Inu meme crypto tokens in October of this year. As I have been telling you guys, the founder Stephen Cooper, the Twitter handle is founder Stephen Cooper. If you guys have watched my previous videos, I've told you guys he's been implementing a community burn, but also have been implementing basically the biggest entertainment, which is selling NFTs, merch, and tickets to events for crypto. So that is what he's been implementing in his company. <coughs> and also allowing the SHIB army to contribute to the amount of SHIB to be destroyed. Besides, users could listen to music tracks on the project's website. That's also helping to burn the second largest meme cryptocurrency, which is Shiba Inu token. And on December 26, the last burn party took, the, took place this year. According to this tweet and this video stream on YouTube, 239 million Shiba Inu tokens were burned or sent to a dead wallet from which these coins cannot be withdrawn or spent. This is equivalent to $9,183, this $239 million ship. <coughs> so guys, before we even get into the total of $880 million, I want to get you guys to understand something. I understand the basis that this may not seem like <coughs> a, lot of <coughs> a lot of money or a lot of ship quantity to you guys, but there's a lot of people that can't even afford $1 million ship. That's probably around $20. So uh, do not complain when you guys see any type of ship burned. It doesn't even matter if it's less than $1 million, if it's more than $1 million, if it's over a billion. Just be happy as long as you're holding ship because most of people don't even have this much in their bank account, to be honest. So you should not be complaining about how much ship is burned. Just be supporting the community as long as you have ship. <coughs> or even if you don't have ship, support the community because once these slow burns happen, they all can be added up together to a bigger number. So understand the concept of that. So if we come down here, you guys can see that initially Cooper hoped to burn 1 billion coins and in several tweets encouraged the SHIB community to support the initiative by pitching in $5. However, his enthusiasm was not shared and only approximately one-fifth of that was incinerated. I understand that people don't want to spend their own money to be burned. Like, because it's not extra money you have to just burn it. you rather hold on to your ship. That's cool. Just hold on to your ship. But don't complain when people are burning and saying that I'm not satisfied with the burn. If you're not satisfied with the burn, then you have your own money to burn. Then do that as well. But overall, since October, Cooper has burned 880 million ship tokens. That's equivalent to the total of $33,000. So $33,000 have been burned so far. Almost $34,000. From the, the from the quantity of Shiba and new tokens, so I just want you guys to understand that, and that's all the news I got for you guys today. So by that being said, guys, I'm you all with you all exchange. I'm the crypto caressa, the forex finessa, and the stock successor. If you guys are new to this channel, or if you guys have been coming back recurring but still have not subscribed, then I urge you guys to subscribe to this channel with the bell notification so you can be notified every single time I drop information packed videos, just like the one you're watching right now. By that being said, guys. God bless. Peace out. I'll see you guys on the next one.